morning. Welcome to another vlog in the life of, uh, well, not doing things the way they are initially planned to do. In this vlog, I figured let's update the uh, kids' room because they like climbing and stuff and they have all these little toys. Uh, so I was looking for mattresses and all that stuff. And then I found an entire play lad for sale. So for the 10 meter, 10 square meter playroom, I accidentally bought a 1200 square meter play lad. <laughs> and I'm not quite sure what's in this playland. We have one truck here, another truck coming, and then a third full semi truck. <laughs> so I'm not quite sure what's in there. And we're out here making snow, of course. Hold yes. on! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a shark! I knew there was a shark. And look, it's like a spiral slide. I guess we used to be called Team Overkill. I guess the Overkill and Team is back. <laughs> but first, we get it off the truck. Well, I guess the carrying begins. Let you go, but have you really gone? for the ski slope. This part of 2.0 ski slope. But this is money. Gina, you gotta not go too tight on the gates. <laughs> I can't wait for the second truck to come because uh, it's kind of like uh, Christmas. Because I wanted to have climbing grips on the wall, but here I get an entire padded wall with uh, animal climbing <laughs> grips. And look at the spiral slide. I feel like I made a, a bargain here. I'm not sure where we're gonna put it. Maybe a bit impulsive. Maybe. But I still think it was a, a catch. Look at that, like that slide, it's a triple slide, triple wide, but triple long. So I can put that next to the staircase outside. Of course you can. <laughs> yeah? Actually, here we go check on the slope. Yeah, let's check that out. I have a check this morning. I gotta angle it a bit. Yeah. I took the light tower down. I was out here last night, obviously. Yep, so this is me. Last night, you know, digging out the cables and the tube, making sure this is angled, and generally liking the snow life. But now I have to sleep, because I know I'll continue this tomorrow with the playland. And so I took it down and tried to angle it, but then the wind shifted. But as you can see, we now have a new mountain snow. Now we're okay with number three still. Might have to go with number one in a bit. But let me angle it. So much better than just buying grips on the wall. There you have a yellow space alien you can climb on. Come here. Like, come on. Who doesn't want the shark at home? Maybe we should cut a hole in, in their house, put the shark through the wall, and this can be the window. <laughs> I'm kind of serious. Like, you know how much, like, all this would cost? Yeah, it's This expensive. is like... I mean, do you know for how many square meters this is? Oh, how big was the play? Playland was 1200, but I think it was two floors. For so nine square meters, you bought something for 600. <laughs> so I think it should be. It should be more than enough. Oh, and if not, we have more. <laughs> now I look forward to the second truck to see what hides in that. Oh! I need more light than the kids' room. Here's a window. We have a little land. So we can come all in the Yeah, they're like. What are you building? <laughs> you know what I just realized? In the last vlog, I was like, I need to clean this place because I can't look like the local junkyard. <laughs> Damn it. But yeah, come on in and we'll show you uh, where all this is going. So I introduced to you where it's all gonna fit or what I was initially redoing. <laughs> we clearly need some more light here. And we cut the... Maybe two? Yeah, two looks better now. Or three? <laughs> or four. I think two. Or I mean, we still don't know what's in the second truck. Shark there, so you can see. Ah, so you go into the shark through the wall. Because yeah. we need to extend this room, clearly. I keep saying we're not going to do more stuff to this house because it's going to get torn down. But the benefit of tearing it down is that you can do things you probably wouldn't do in a regular house. What we're going to do, we're going to wait for the second truck to like get a, a grip of what's coming. I wish I didn't like stuff like this this much. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it brings out the kid okay, in me. Right. 
So while we wait for the second truck, uh, I know you probably wonder quite a bit what is happening with the house build and all this stuff. And to be honest, it's going a bit slow because I've been doing ski slopes, I apply lens and all this stuff. But one thing I know is that now when we're getting closer, I'm getting into details. Like you really like, instead of like, here's the house, here's this and this, and then you learn how you want everything to be. So that is why today's collaboration with Skillshare that you know I've been using for a long time is perfect. Because in order for me to do everything, like I built stuff in 3D in the past, but I've done it in Rhino, which is a bit complex. But now I've started to try and learn Blender, um, which I think is gonna be better for the 3D stuff I do. And and since it's a new 3D program, there's a lot of learning. And that's why the Skillshare classes, especially the learning paths, so that you can like kind of start from the right place and then build your way up. Because I love doing stuff in 3D. It's just difficult in the beginning, but so rewarding when you figure it out. So what I'm watching right now is build 3D models and animation with Blender with classes from Derek Elliott. And it's super helpful going from where I am now and then trying to build to where I can visualize this entire place. So Skillshare is the largest online learning community for creatives with thousands of classes led by industry pros across film, design, freelance, productivity, and more. Something that I enjoy is their learning path that help you find a solid starting point for your goals with hand-picked classes meant to be taken in the right order that build on another, reinforcing lessons. They are available in a range of experience levels from beginner to advanced, and a variety of categories including design, productivity, creative, freelancing, tools, and software like Procreate and Blender, marketing, and more. You can learn at your own speed and they have classes from beginner to advanced. The 500 first people to use the link in my description will get a one month free trial on Skillshare. So grab your spot and, well, maybe not do like me, like build a playland, but learning is always fun. And then tonight, if there's energy, I'm gonna work on my 3D skills, but now, <laughs> Ready <to> Let's go. <laughs> the randomness. Just gets better and better. Very random. So many things you don't actually know what it is. <laughs> Benches. That's the beauty with kids. That you never really actually know what they like. Now we have a variety. This looks like a little carousel. You know. Like, look, look at this thing. Ah! It's like spinning. It's a boat carousel. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? I don't know. It's, a, it's like 3000 Lego without an instruction or like an image of what it's supposed to be. I know there's supposed to be what? eight ball cannons. Eight of them. Eight of them. I just noticed that you said eight. Choice. <laughs> <laughs> Like a giant inflatable teddy. <laughs> Leia will love that. So what he stands? Yeah, it's a giant teddy. On here we have a bomb. <laughs> I think I saw a picture. This set on the second floor. This is like a ball collector that gets the balls from downstairs to upstairs, maybe. Yeah. And so this was the initial idea that I wanted uh, to get mattresses for the playroom. So this <laughs> is what I set out to buy. <laughs> Then it went a bit more. But you know how much like mattresses are for kids' room? It's like 300 euros for one of these. What? Okay, I didn't expect that. Well, you have a few now. <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch coming. Yeah, then we just have to figure out where to put where. Have you seen this? This is a spinning carousel yeah, boat. So it hurt. Yeah, so so. <laughs> you need anything for your house? No, nothing. <laughs> Please, no. So, second truck just finished unloading. And yeah, we have a third truck coming. And it's starting to uh, become clear to me that uh, once again, I've taken uh, like we say in Sweden, vatten over huvudet, water over your head. No shit, you. <laughs> My brother was like, no, no, no. <laughs> but look here, this is like ready to go. That's like the only thing that we to put together. Then I have to sort and figure out where everything goes. And you got a bunch of these. <laughs> Lego for adults. But I need to go back and look at the picture, how, how it was assembled. I had three poor pictures. Uh, I was like, sweet. And then figure out what to use where. But we figured out that the inflatable teddy yeah. is sitting on a rotating engine. That's really cool. So that's good. At least we have enough protection for the trees around the ski slope. But come on, like. 
how much stuff. is Leia gonna love this? We won't win any interior decoration awards, but we're not here to win awards. We're here to entertain kids. Anything you can do to minimize iPad time, that is our goal here. That is why we've created a giant headache for ourselves. <laughs> Probably tang in the roof. <laughs> Usually I kind of, I can see things. That's how we do it. Wait, wait, wait. Let's cut back to the simulator. I always have these ideas that like, awesome, sweet. And now I'm like, I guess I'm not like, chilling tonight either. Well, I'm not, I'm like, I can have a vision. <laughs> yes. I can see the no problem, but I see a headache here. I'm not gonna lie, but I know it's gonna be good. I kind of want to see how many pieces we have for like the tunnel quite or slide. A, yeah, I think quite a few. Even the truck driver was like, <laughs> okay, I'm finished here and I wish you all the luck in the world. I think you're gonna need it. <laughs> We're gonna have to turn off the camera for a bit and get serious, otherwise it's gonna look like this forever. Uh, yeah, we'll be back in a bit once we have somewhat of a plan. It's pretty organized. Right behind you. Oh, I didn't even see that. You know, seeing what useful things we have for the playroom <laughs> and what we got to find alternatives for. Because look here, mm -hmm. all the balls are mixed with like old yeah. crappy ones. Yeah. So we're going to start with getting things under control. Uh, but it's a lot. <laughs> look, one tunnel, two tunnels. Well, uh, what is this? Stuff that Leon loved in Cyprus, remember? I know, it's the stuff you have at Playlands. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is gonna take a bit of work. And I just cleaned this garden like a week ago, thinking I wasn't gonna be the junkyard of the, of the neighborhood. <laughs> when you hear like parents and the teachers and the school across, they're like amazed of the stupidity, but they love it. Okay, so we have a plan. So here, we're gonna block this wardrobe or remove. So then maybe you can enter it from the backside because Fabian had the great idea. We make a second floor. That's smart. Since we have the third truck coming, we gotta like figure out if anything's gonna go through the wall, most likely. <laughs> most likely. But to be mature, we're gonna start with a second floor. Um, kind of build from there. <laughs> oh no. I'm a handyman. You didn't even take the towels out. All day today I felt reverse progress. Maybe breaking the wardrobe isn't exactly progress, but I mean, you gotta be efficient. We don't have all the time in the world here. Teamwork. Teamwork is the dream work. My plan was kind of to end this vlog uh, at the end of the day, doing all that stuff. But I was pretty tired. And then I just wanted to throw some stuff into the room so you can kind of see what we're working with here. So you're ready for, well, I mean, not big transformation, but at least we are started so I could see how things look in here. You ready for the beautiful? And I present to you the 1.0 Olson Home Playland. <laughs> Look at this sea of balls. Leon and Leia have been cleaning all of these in the bathtub. No, 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 no. No, no. Yeah. Hittar ni nåt fina då? No, no, no. No, no. No, no. Oh. No, 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 no. And I've been going up and down, well, like a million times. And this here, mega hit. They're just swinging and then letting go. So uh, that was actually Leon's idea as well. I didn't put that up. And then we got the beautiful cartoon guys on the wall. Random stuff. We got carpets on the floor. And then we don't have a wardrobe anymore. We have a climbing wall. 
I know it's really pretty. <laughs> But yeah, that, that is where we are at the moment. Um, so we got most of the stuff up in the house now, almost uh, empty down there. <laughs> or not. I would say maybe we managed to get roughly 1% of the stuff down there up here. But at least, I mean, now it's already sort of worth it once we get the slides up and, and stuff. We set that up, uh, well, halfway through yesterday. And I have never ever seen my kids play for that long and having that much fun. So. It might be purple, it might be turquoise, and it might not be, well, the prettiest thing you can have in a house, but kids love it. So, super happy, but I still have some work to do, but I wanted to, well, end this vlog and give you an update. So, more updates to come with holes in the wall and um, tunnels, um, ski slopes, all that stuff. It looks kind of like organized in here, but then that guy that's not fully in control of his life is back. Only two vlogs ago, I was like, I need to get my life under... No, that was last vlog. Life is not under control for the person that lives here. But that person is at least having fun and his kids are having more fun. So, well, come back next uh, weekend and uh, we'll see what happens then. But I am happy. <laughs> Peace out. Actually, I have to show this. The reason we got that room together in like no time was because we cheated and put everything that was in here <laughs> in here. So time to fix this as well. See you in the next one.